and family are remembering a Mishawaka teenager hit and killed by a train. A memorial is growing outside near the train tracks where 16-year-old Elijah Brooks was killed yesterday afternoon. It happened near Twickenham Drive, just 100 yards from where another person was killed Tuesday. WSBT 22's Alex Elich is at the live desk for us tonight. Alex, police say walking along the tracks is dangerous. Kristen, in both deaths, the victims were walking along the side tracks, clipped and killed on impact. Police said yesterday at the scene that Brooks most likely thought the train was farther away than it was. This is devastating to those who knew the 16-year-old Mishawaka High School student. And I was able to talk with a close friend of his who shared some of his memories. Playing basketball will never be the same for Noah Devine. His friend, 16-year-old Elijah Brooks, was hit and killed by a train yesterday when he was walking alongside the tracks. He loved playing basketball. He was, his favorite player was KD. He always wore his KD shirt all the time. Noah found out about his close friend's death on Twitter. He was shocked. Half of you, when you first hear it, you want to almost call him. Be like, dude, is this for real? Like, are, is this really you? But can't. Noah said Elijah's dream was to join the Navy and eventually become a firefighter. They played basketball several times a week. In fact, just a few days ago, the two were together on the court. Said when you're just going to play basketball with somebody, you never know if that's going to be the last time you're going to be able to be like, hey, Eli, I got you on my team. He said that Elijah always had a smile on his face and loved to crack jokes. Now, though, Noah can only reflect on a life lost too early and a hoops buddy that can't be replaced. I love you, man, and I'm glad that you're in a better place now. I hate that it had to happen so soon, but I know in a few, you and a few other people are watching over me, and I'm thankful for that, and I hope you guide me and everybody else you cared about down the right path and watch over us. I talked with other friends of Brooks, and they also said that he was a good friend and a positive person. I also just talked to the Mishawaka High School principal, and he says they're offering counseling at the school tomorrow and Tuesday. At the live desk, Alex Elich, WSBT 22 News.